The Kaiku-1 Zurian is a twin-engine, transport utility helicopter developed primarily by Korean Aerospace Industries, Kai, Agency for Defense Development and Korean Aerospace Research Institute jointly with Eurocopter. In 2006, the research and development phase of the Korea Helicopter Project, Korea Utility Helicopter, costing around 1.3 trillion won, $1.2 billion, was launched by the Agency for Defense Development. In 2012, full-scale production of the Zurian commenced. Kai has been designated as the principal manufacturer of the type. An initial force of around 245 Zurians have been ordered by the Republic of Korea Army to replace their aging fleets of UH-1H utility helicopters and 500 MD light utility helicopters which have been in service for decades. Kai shall also construct civilian and law enforcement variants of the helicopter. The Kai Kuan Zurian is a twin-engine medium-sized multi-purpose rotor craft, carrying up to nine troops along with a crew of four, two pilots and two gunners in the main cabin area, in a utility transport capacity. It has been designed to be rapidly reconfigured to serve different trolls. Some models are also novelized. The Zurian can perform various duties and roles, such as military transport, law enforcement, aerial observation, search and rescue, maritime support, aerial firefighting, and for civilian purposes along with other missions. Power is provided by a pair of 1600 SHP Hanwha Tequin T700 SD701 K turbo shaft engines, a license-built localized development of the General Electric T700. The Zurian is equipped with various survivability and damage reduction features. Both the airframe and the cockpit have been made bulletproof against small arms fire. The airframe, tail rotor, and the rotor blades used on both the main and tail rotors are of a crash-worthy construction. Anti-explosion sealed fuel tanks are also used. The main gearbox is capable of flying for a limited period after suffering the loss of lubricating oil. Various electronic defensive measures are incorporated onto the Zurian, such as a countermeasures dispenser system, radar warning receiver and a laser warning receiver. Performance-wise, the helicopter will have a cruise speed of 259 km per hour with a range of 530 kilometers. The armament will consist of missiles, six BGM-71 tow, or up to four rocket pods. On the 22nd of May 2013, a handover ceremony of 10 Zurians was conducted to mark the helicopter's deployment at the Army Aviation School in Onsen, South Chungguang Province, attended by President Park jun hye The Kuan performed its first operational mission in August 2015 conducting medevac in the aftermath of North Korean artillery shells that struck South Korean territory near the Korean demilitarized zone. Since entering service, the Zurian has reportedly held an availability rate in excess of 80%. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe, like, and share it with your friends.